good evening guys so it is another small vlog for you guys Tegan is currently in there as well she's down there but um we are heading off to Bristol and Bath rugby hence why I have a Bristol Bears um tracksuit jacket on which I need to quickly sort out but um yeah the time is currently half past five the game is at quarter to eight there's no point asking you because you're not going to know what time it is but um no, the game is quarter to eight, so it's me, Dad, Tegan, who are going. I'm driving, so you didn't this say one. Carson. Huh? You didn't say Carson. Carson's not coming. Did you not? <laughs> Did you not know? Carson's. He didn't want a ticket. I asked him ages ago, and he was like, no, I don't want to go. So it's basically like Dad with his, like, his two favourite daughters. Oh my god. What's I know. Thing? So, um, yeah, it's, um, we're going off to watch Bristol and Bath. Last year when we played them at Ashton Gate, we absolutely thrashed them. So fingers crossed it's the same again this year. But um, we're basically leaving in half an hour because I don't drink that often. So I said I will drive because our friend has given us their member tickets. We'll be able to park in the Ashton Gate Stadium. But we're just getting ready now because I'm basically wrapping up. I've got like my Tegan's Champion top on. My pull and bear. My pull and bear. My Bristol Bears fleece. My um, Gucci belts and cargo and just my white converse and then I'm wearing Tegan's Bushka puffer coat and then Tegan's wearing my red one but we obviously sat down in a rugby game so you're literally not moving so it's actually going to be absolutely freezing as soon as that sun goes down but again it's only going to be like um 80 minutes out in the stadium and then we'll probably go into the bar we usually have a little bit of music playing and we'll probably see all our rugby family and dad always sees everyone he knows when we go to these rugby matches so yes but i thought i'll take the camera and just do a little bit of filming there because um i want you guys to see what i get up to and also what rugby games are actually like i have had such an irritating nose today and it just keeps running and literally i don't even want to up and get a tissue so all my makeup's going to come off but um yes i'm going to take the camera do a bit of um filming vlog in there for you but it is meant to be really really busy because bath and bristol are two of the highest teams where i live but as again as again hopefully we will thrash bath but i will see you guys when we get there say bye ciao okay ciao see you later <laughs> we need to find up where's dad <laughs> Yes, honey. <laughs> Just try not to get killed. Oh. Oh, thank you. What do I do? Scan your ticket.
This lighting is so not okay. Hey, I'm drunk. <laughs> oh my God. Right, we're literally so wrapped up for winter because we've literally just left the Bristol rugby game and back in my car because I've not told you guys the story, but... <laughs> Tegan's store basically left mine um, to drive to the Bristol game and we what happened to the car? It got really smoky so and really lit. Hold pets. on. Okay, she put oil in her car and she left the, the oil cap off. <laughs> so we're driving, the car is steaming. Everyone <laughs> thinks the car is on fire. There's smoke everywhere. We pull over and Dad's like, Bronnie, where's your oil cap? She's like, <laughs> I don't know. And then I've left it on the side of the road outside our house. So I've literally forgot to put the pet uh, petrol, the oil cap. <laughs> and it's all leaked for us I've drove, so we've literally had to leave the car wherever we are and get an Uber in, but then Mitch has kindly picked us up, dropped me back, and I can now drive this one to I'm drunk! <laughs> <laughs> what do you want? A, a what? A McDonald's. A, a little baby meal. So I now need to divert and go the longer route home instead of going straight home, so I hope but you appreciate I'm this. I'm loving it. But no, the game was very, very well. Dad met Pam Lamb, who is Bristol's head coach, because he's such a cutie, so we got a Right, so my camera died because the storage was full, so I've literally just sorted that out. But yeah, as I said, it's literally two minutes past I'm midnight. <laughs> Everyone knows that. I'm driving this drunk one to go and get a McDonald's because she wants a happy meal. <laughs> Baby meal. What time do they shut? It's like two minutes past 12. And it like what, one. What one are you going to? Well, the one in Briz, because that's the closest one. Always open, always go there when I'm drunk. Okay, brilliant. So we're going to drive there now, and I'm sure I'll probably do a recording when we're there to see if this one actually gets her food or not. So yeah, I will catch up with you guys later. Say bye, drunk lady. Bye, I'm drunk. Coke, please. Will you coke, yeah? Yes, please. Uh, yes. That's it, thank you. Okay, nice one, please. Thank, thank you. you. We love McDonald's, yeah. I think we've literally just caught them whilst they're closing. No, they're open, there's people inside. But they're cleaning, so I think they're soon closing. Well, can you, can I, can I? Yeah, watch the fucking pole. I don't know if I do that. Oh, a bit, a bit, bit far. I'm gonna have to like put them in over. Oh, can I pick? Sorry, oh can I pick up that? It's gonna work. What a lovely gentleman. Yeah, and you? I don't know who's talking to me. I am literally exhausted, I'm not gonna lie. What did you get? Did you get a hamburger or a cheeseburger? I don't know. <laughs> you just ordered it. 
Oh, it's a little Halloween box. Look. Oh my God, no way. No, it was such kids. Literally. Oh my God, look. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you. Have you? a lovely night. Oh my God. Thank you. What, are so, you happy now? Can we can I go me home? Two oh, maybe you thought we were sharing it. Right. Brownie's driving. Right, let's say okay, bye to bye. the vlog. <laughs> <laughs> Camera, you're driving. Bye, guys. Bye, love you.